Okay, this game is Crate Games, um, where we're going to teach the dog that when we put our hand onto the crate or the latch, that it will always mean that they are to move into a sit. So we're gonna shape this by allowing the dog to make a choice, and it's gonna need, you're gonna need to have some patience in doing this for certain dogs. So I'm gonna start by playing with my dog. Are you ready? Are you ready? Get it. Yes, good job. Awesome, awesome. Yes, good job, good job. All right, yes. Good job, Sky. Let's put this on here, okay? And you get your dog in the crate however you normally would. That's not how I would normally get my dog in the crate, but we'll go with that. Okay. So, here's where mechanics are very, very important. My left hand, because my door opens on the right, my left hand will always be the hand that touches it and unlatches it and opens it. My right hand will be the one that I treat with, up high and in the back. My left hand will always close. So, let me see if I can put her in a down, which you normally would not do. Down. Good. Excellent. Excellent. So, I'm going to put my hand on the door and watch what happens. Yes. She moved right to a sit. I open it with my left. Feed with my right. Close. Now, if your dog goes back down to a down, you just start the process over again. If they're not going anywhere when you put your hand on there, wait for a little while. If they still don't do it, then go back to week one on crate games where you're building more value for that sit position in the crate. Um, if they are in a sit, then you just keep putting your hand on the crate, open, feed, close. Tap left, open left, feed right, Close left. Notice I'm also able to sit on the side so that when I open the door, it's all the way open. So she could pop out here real easily. I'm not blocking the doorway. So I'm going to tap, open, feed, close. And that's Crate Games with the hand on it. Be patient with this. It may take five or six seconds before the dog goes to a sit. And if they don't go to a sit, all that tells you is that they need more value for that sit position in your crate. So you go back to week one. And remember that when you are through with this game, to reward your dog by playing tug with them. 